See us? Put a webcam in front of elementary students and you'll get a variety of responses. Put a webcam in front of PE teacher Mr. Marcus Dalton and you'll get... Oh, what's up first grade? Hey, what's up? My fault, I was working on my dance moves. It's Mr. Dalton, or you can call me Mr. D. Welcome to the Panther Cub gym. Hi, Cradle Club. Hi, Miss Paige. And my dog Petey says hi. Boys and girls, welcome back. It's week two. His enthusiasm and, dare we say, style hey. caught our eyes for the Golden She's Apple so Award. His students so put us over the edge. I remember when it was my first time doing virtual, and Mr. Dalton had me laughing to tears. He cares about his students more than anything. I like Mr. Dalton because he is a lot of fun. He shows love, and he support the kids. Plus, he has music and has a lot of energy, and he makes everyone feel like his family. Before the pandemic, he was great in class. He makes funny jokes. My first day of school, I thought I was going to be like nervous and like all shy, but after, after I was in gym, like I felt like I don't know, I just felt like I let all that nervousness out. But now for some kids, he's the highlight of virtual learning. Oh, I don't need this, do I? Whenever he records a video every single week, he just seems like really happy about it, even though he doesn't like being virtual. He just is like enthusiastic about it and makes his, wants his students to like engage in it. Just like brings that good and positive energy. And then you're like, all right, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. And then you're like, you're like jump roping really fast. You're like, yay. He like speaks our language. Um, he's very, I mean, I'm motivated. I, I, like I said, I film him all the time and I'm sending it to like my, my older son. And then I'm like, he's wild. Like, <laughs> and he doesn't want anyone to feel left out. He used to come to my house to like help me with my basketball skills and improve my ball handling. So he just like came over and just, he volunteered. And I remember like him saying, if you need a jump rope, just let me know and I will give you the jump rope. Like he didn't, he didn't care at all. He was like, he was like, I'll drop it by your house. I'll give you your jump rope. And it just, that just made me like feel like that's so nice because he didn't have to do that. He even calls some students just to check in. We talk about like how have we say how have your mom and dad been and I say good and we just talk about stuff. He's impressed the parents. So basically like how the regular teacher do, like their actual teacher, class teacher, they reach out to them to make sure, you know, everything is okay, you know, to let them know we still miss you guys, you know. I mean you can definitely spot where Mr. Dalton is at any of the events because there's like tons of kids surrounded around him. <laughs> We've had sleepovers with kids from school and I'm always asking like, what's your favorite class? Who's your favorite teacher? And it's always, it's always Mr. D. Go. His personality and his hustle is teaching students something. He's taught me to be me and to like, just don't let anybody get in your way. He also teaches me like to always put a smile on your face no matter what because smiles are contagious and you can give it to anybody else. I remember like my third grade teacher like vividly and I think Mr. Dalton probably is gonna have that effect on 90% of the kids he's been in contact with at Nora. So today they say thank you. Thank you for all you've done for me by helping me and guiding me through kindergarten and just like making gym as fun as possible. I love your teaching and you're very funny. Thank you for always putting smiles on my face. I think you're the best teacher because you show the kids love and support and you make sure their moms and dads is okay and she's feel like the best teacher ever. Thank you, Mr. Dalton, for being my gym teacher. You have brought so much joy and smiles to me and to my whole family. I love you.